Hi, welcome. Thanks for joining today. Uh, I'll start off by saying if you're a regular viewer um, to the channel and you've subscribed, I really appreciate that. I've just hit a little bit of a milestone, 5,000 subscribers. So if you're one of them, I'm very grateful. Um, thanks for watching the videos. So it's spring now and the fish uh, are concentrating on feeding on buzzers. And they will do, do that all the way through the spring and into the summer. Now, as the fish feed on the buzzers, they feed on them all the way through the water column. And this particular fly, uh, it's a top hat version. It's going to target the fish that are eating the buzzers in the surface film. Um, and it's very productive. If you've seen some of my previous videos, you can see how many fish you can catch using these top hats. So we'll get on tying. Um, the hook I've got in the vise is a, a Hanek size 16, 230BL. Um, the body of the fly is going to be um, black and it's nano silk and 12O. Um, for the float the fly in the surface filling, I'm going to use um, circular uh, high density foam cylinders. Um, you can get them in different colours. You can buy them already cut, pre-cut. And uh, they're waspy. Wopsy, sorry, not waspy. Wopsy. Um, and if you've seen one of my previous videos, I cut my own uh, so you can do different sizes if you if you buy some cutters. The body of the fly is going to be brown um, flexi floss. So we need a bit of that. So... We'll get on tying. We'll get tie behind the eye, cast the thread on. Now, with this nano silk, it's it's quite slippy, but very, very strong. Lovely stuff. But what I tend to do, where I'm going to be putting the foam, is just put a little bit of super glue just on the thread there. Now, the foam cylinder which is obviously a black one I'm going to put a little V in it tied onto the onto the shank of the hook now that little bit of super glue will help with keep it in position we'll, we'll go around the front a couple of times and then we'll start cinching this down so because we don't want it to move around once it's once it's bent down onto the shank, I'm going to keep it in that position. So we'll, we'll tighten that down. And then we'll go, start to go down the body. Now we don't need all that foam on. You want about half the length of the body. And that will uh, float the fly no problem. You can always cut it down a bit if it's uh, flat calm and you want it to sit, sit a bit lower. So we'll get our uh, piece of body material, the brown uh, flexi floss. We'll tie that in, leaving a bit that we can get a hold of later on. Now we're going to go down the body and pull. I'm pulling this tight now to reduce the bulk because we want it obviously quite slim at the the bottom end of the fly, like what the shape of a buzzer is. And then we'll come back up and just create a bit of tape at towards the top. And then we'll get up, we'll cut that excess off, we'll pull this tight and cut that off. I'll shape our body a little bit more. Now Put tension on this, we'll be pulling this round for our first couple, and then we'll start to rib the body. And as I go up the body, I'll start to ease off the tension so it actually it, uh, makes a nice segmented body up to the top. And then we'll just go over and we'll tie that off, keep it tied in. That's it, and then we'll again pull this tight, 
it went off. Now, so once that rib's tied in, we'll um, take a bit of varnish, thin varnish, and we'll we'll put it um, we'll put a, just a coating on that on that rib. And that will go onto the onto the rib material and sink down into the thread. That's it. So what we're going to do to finish the fly off is we need a, a little bit of thorax just uh, behind that bit of foam there. So we'll take a bit of um, black rabbit, a bit of black hair there, and just dub it on and create a thorax. Go through it with a with a thread. Get a little bit of super glue on your thread, and then we'll just go through that two or three turns. Finish it off. Well, could we any right long? straggly bits I want uh, we do want some bushy bits around the thorax and there you have it so it's black rib brown body quite natural black uh, thorax kink this up and then this fly will sit in the surface film and there's a come around taking the uh, the buzzers that's stuck in the surface film before the hatch you'll catch a lot of fish on this it's it's a natural looking fly so if you've enjoyed that uh please hit the like button if you haven't already subscribed please subscribe and check out uh my other videos thanks for watching cheers now